What is going on, guys? So it has been exactly one year since I put a thousand dollars into my Fundrise account, and I want to show you guys exactly the results after one year. Um, it's not horrible. It's not great. Uh, but really, let's just jump right into it. So as of now, I made about fifty nine thirty four off of my thousand dollar investment, of which you can see I reinvested the majority of that. Um, so what does that really mean? So if you actually go to my transactions, you can kind of see that in June of last year, I put in $1,000. And now, over the past uh, year and month, I guess you could say, I've accumulated you know, $57 worth of dividends. So I got $1.50 when I first started, um, obviously because I was only invested for a partial amount of the time. And then, you know, $15, another $15, and then another $12.60, and then another $13. Most recently, is that today? Uh, yeah, today. So um, that's what reminded me to make this video. But so what does that actually end up meaning? Um, so if you actually look at the performance plot, um, total earnings to date is $59.34. You can see basically where I am and where they potentially predict me to go in terms of this funnel. Uh, over the next 20 years or so. But this is really how it stemmed. It's kind of a straightish line. You can see a curve over in about j early January of last year. But then if you look at basically this, these items that I'm invested in, and you notice that I've only basically made a 6% a return of total earnings, you could say, um, in terms of dividends, you kind of say, okay, well, that's pretty interesting considering a lot of the items are actually saying that they're in the 8 to 16 percent range and a lot of my basically a lot of my investments from Fundrise are actually between 8 and 16 uh, percent so it's a little bit interesting that within a year's worth of time my actual investment has only gone up by you know six or so percent but with my six percent basically return in dividends and reinvesting those dividends this is really what it ended up being so here's that you know 57 or 58 dollars that I've received or the six sixty dollars I've received in you know capital your yeah capital payback from these projects and with that return I've made a 7.7 percent uh, increase so without investing the dividends back into the business uh, or in this case, the, the Fundrise account, I would have been stuck with a 5.7, 5.8% return. But because I reinvested, I got an additional 2%, 2 basically. Um, not horrible, but like I said, if, if you think about it, over, this, over the same term in the stock market, uh, probably would have netted me about 20%, maybe on the upwards of 30%, depending on what stock I would have put this into. So if you think about it, yes, it's very nice. It's a passive version of income. Uh, it's real estate. You know, I don't really have to, to cater to it. But it's still somewhat confusing as to why, you know, the majority of my investments show I only have one investment in Ann Arbor, Michigan that's below 8% returns, but I've only gotten a 7.7 percent return and that's after I've reinvested you know my six percent dividend income that I've made throughout the year or so so um, it's still a little bit mind-boggling to me I'm not upset with Fundrise and big part of it could be the fees associated with Fundrise that could be one or two percent as well uh, but at the end of the day it still seems a little off as to why you know, they're saying that you get these sorts of returns, but at the end of the day, you get only, you know, a portion of that. Um, so, interesting. But anyway, so that's my take on it. Uh, I'll continue to keep you guys updated. Uh, there's a couple other features that I'm probably going to make a video about that just came out. Um, so stay tuned for those. And of course, you know, like, subscribe, and everything like that. Uh, I'm at 950 subscribers, so if we can get to that thousand mark, of course, I'll be giving away something uh, to show you guys my appreciation of following me on the channel uh, and everything like that. But otherwise, I'll keep you guys posted on my dividend journey as well as my Fundrise account and uh, also my app uh, development, if that ends up coming through at all and there's anything to talk about that. 
Um, so have a great day, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks.